Welcome to Now, I'm your host, Curtis Parody, and today's episode is all about trains, boats, tigers, and the 3DS. Starting today's episode with what I could say is my favorite form of transportation, trains! I like trains! Yep, so this news comes from Europe and it's all about their devotion to their high-speed train system. I'm amazed by the amount of trains in the countries in Europe and I have to say that they're not the slow trains we typically see in North America. No, these are the trains that go fast, like let's say 125 kilometers an hour fast. That's fast. So in a new document released recently, it shows the devotion to building out the high-speed train systems in Europe by 2025. In the map that you can see on the screen, all the red lines are the current high-speed lines and the dotted lines are the high-speed lines projected to be completed in 2025. For myself, as I've never actually used the system, I have to say it looks pretty impressive. They are expanding the network considerably. I only wish my Canadian government would take notice. Like really, we have one highway that goes all across the country, why not a high-speed train system as well? I, for one, am all for as I'm actually not a big fan of, you know, flying. I like to stay on the ground. Also, I don't think you have to go through all the security, so, you know, that's a good sign. Maybe someday in the future, Canada will have a high-speed train system, but I highly doubt it. From land transportation to water transportation, wouldn't you just love to be sitting out on the ocean on something like this? Well then today is your lucky day! Because one lucky viewer at home will be soon getting this luxury yacht that looks like a floating island. Sorry, I forgot this is now and not The Price is Right. No prize for you! Anyway, this cool floating island would be perfect for you if you have, let's say, three million dollars to spare. Maybe for like a cool jet set getaway or an evil layer. Either or works. And if you buy it for evil layer purposes, I personally will throw in a personalized cape for free. This cool floating island boat is a new take on the smaller yacht form factor as it looks nothing like a traditional boat. But I have a feeling that it won't travel too fast because look at it, it doesn't exactly scream speed. The next topic doesn't exactly scream speed, but it does have a bigger screen. Having already done 3D, Nintendo now wants to go big with its new 3DS XL. The 3DS XL has a 90% larger screen than the original 3DS. It also carries a stronger battery to support the larger screen and is bundled with a four gigabyte flash card to hold all your downloadable content. This new console will be available in July for people living in Europe and Japan. And for people living in North America, look out for it in mid-August, retailing for around $199. So if you're interested in playing some 3D Mario on a larger screen, look out for this new device. And last but certainly not least, at least in my mind, a story came out today about a woman named Orr from South Africa that has both a dangerous job but super cool one at the same time. But isn't that how it like always is with dangerous jobs? Like being an astronaut, super cool, but also pretty dangerous because if something goes wrong when you're up in space, well, that's not good. So Orr works at the Seaview Lion Park in South Africa, and her day job consists of taking care of these big cats, full-size Siberian tigers. Now, if you don't already know, tigers are like my favorite animal of all time because I love cats, but tigers are like big cats. Big is always better, right? Okay, maybe not, but tigers are freaking cool and I'm pretty jealous that she gets to play around with these guys, as long as they don't try to eat her. Now she did raise these cats from birth. Look at them, they're so cute. So being raised by her from birth brings a lot of benefits to them trusting her and not attacking her. Now you already know I would love to have one of these cats, but what about yourself? Would you actually like to have a tiger? Let's say if it wouldn't eat you or if it was the size of a dog, would you have one? Tell me in the comment section below, or you can tell me on Facebook, Twitter, or Google+. Links to all that and more in the description below. And when you're done commenting, why not click the subscribe button above so that all the newest episodes of Now get sent straight to you. Then click the like button below because you like this video, you like the content in it, or you like me. One of the three. I'm Curtis Parody, and that's what's happening now.